guys welcome to the channel my name is Claire and this is Polly put the petal on I don't know why I said it like that my name is Claire and this is Polly put the petal on and today I have a Shein haul for you um with a try on so I've got uh three dresses and I've got one skirt now the skirt I don't think I'm going to try on but I'm going to show it you anyway the reason why I'm not going to show it on is because um it doesn't suit my body my body shape and I'll explain that to you as we go along I've also got some household bits too um so yeah and, and I've got one accessory so I'm going to start off with this now I'm already using this so I've taken it out of the box but I kept the box in the bag because obviously I wanted to show it you this came in at £2.26 um and it's original price now I've got my glasses here there they are and it's original price without the without the discounts that you get you know the lovely generous discounts that you get it was 275 and i'd seen it all over tiktok this um oil spray bottle so that's it there i think my top's gold um and then the oil let me go and get yeah, it guys it's absolutely brilliant and for what did we say 2 pound 26 so that's it that's the bottle and then you just press it press it down and it's got quite a forceful spray on it i mean i use a spray oil anyway i don't use um you know i'm on slimming world and i certainly don't use that um one cal spray because it's got so many chemicals in it they ruin your pans as well so you know if, if they're doing that to your pan what they're doing to your insides what's it doing to your insides that's the way i see things anyway um so yeah do, do i need to adjust that no, that's it so yeah, I, um, I I use oil. So this is just uh, rapeseed oil because that's quite a friendly oil to use. And you know, I lightly spray whatever I'm whatever I'm um, needing. You know, my frying pan or anything like that. I don't fry deep fry. I don't um, shallow fry as such. I will literally just put a, a smattering of this on. If if because um, because like I say, it's got quite a good force of of um, spray that comes off it so if i think oh that's enough oil because obviously i am on slimming world then i just get a um, silicon um pastry brush and then you know paint it around the pan um so yeah that is fabulous um and so worth the two pound 26 even worth the two pound 75 the full price um and like i say i'd seen it on tiktok there's quite a um on the tiktok shop um, and, I, uh, and I think it's on a par with the TikTok shop, you know, price wise as well. So, yeah, that's how it came in its box and I'm using it already and I think it's brilliant. So I thought I'd share that with you. Um, still sticking with the kitchen bits, I also got this digital thermometer because mine is one of those, those dial ones that you stick into your meat. Um, and then the dial comes up, you know, and you've got a picture of a pig and a cow and a, and a chicken and stuff. Um, so I thought, well, let's push the boat out. And how much was this? It was one pound sixty-five reduced with the with the discount. Should have been two full price, but I got it for one sixty-five. And it's just your it's just your your metal prong that goes into your meat or your foods or into your pan if you if you've got something on a rolling boil and stuff. You know, when you need to bring it up to temperature, um, and you know it, that's your display there. And um, I mean, yeah, I need to. I haven't. I haven't um, used it to see if if it works at all properly. So I will have to put that to the test. But I wanted to share that with you as well because um, I'm definitely going to give it a go. And until I'm until I'm I'm certain, I won't be throwing my dial, my old style dial out either. So yeah, I thought that was good for what did we say? 165. Um, the next thing that I picked up was this travel document um pouch. I have and have done, I've had this bag um that I keep um passports and um you know your e hit cards in and stuff, you know, your European health insurance card and stuff. I have it in a it's like a red almost like a red um makeup bag and um you know i've had that for about 12 12 10 or 12 years 
um, and it's time it was changed because it's very cumbersome you know where where i keep it when i'm taking it in and out it's very cumbersome and then to take it you know uh, with you on your holiday it's you're having to swap and change in fact sometimes we we just leave that at home and we we pack it we pack our documents somewhere else so i saw this on um shein i mean that's a little bit wonky that badge but i've just straightened it up saw that on um shein and i thought oh yeah that's good now it's got a um back pocket there for i don't know i actually think you could put your passports you know if you don't want to open the whole thing you know when you when you at first when you're checking in you need to show your documents you could put that in there but inside it's got loads of pockets and i thought that is brilliant and i got a neutral color um and then you've got your pockets here which are quite which are quite deep as you can see so you've got one two three and then you've got this um fourth pocket but that's like an, a net pocket and then you've got one two three four five pockets here and I'm assuming in there you can keep the odd coin. I'm not sure what what you would put in those because they're not, they're not very deep. You know those shiny ones there. And then again, you've got a zip compartment there that's clear, so you could definitely put your coins in there. You've got another zip there, um, and that's really nice and deep. So once you've shown them out of that pocket, you can put them into that pocket for for security because i don't think i'd like to put them in these in case when you opened it you know they slipped out you just don't know do you um i like the security of those zipped pockets to be honest with you but i think this is so much better you can even put a little pen there look it's so much better than um you know you can keep your your emergency numbers in it and all that sort of stuff you know um your your insurance policy numbers and all that um it's got a pocket on the front that's a nice deep pocket too um i just think it's it's less cumbersome than what i've already got for a start um nice and compact perfect for putting in your hand luggage you know um it's just brilliant and to put in the safe when you get when you get to wherever you're going or indeed wherever you're going it's it's handy enough to store in a drawer or or whatever you know if you if you're holidaying in in um if you're holidaying in britain and you're using it for whoops you're using it for um you know because you still have insurance if you're holidaying in britain don't you if you're using it for anything else you know i think i just think it's ideal so i thought i'd bring that to you and that was a travel wallet and family passport holder casual canvas document organizer case with zipper that's the description and it would have been 575 full price but with a discount i got it for four pound 72 and i think it's fabulous compared to what i'm using at the moment and have been using for the past 10 years so um what are we moving on to now i'm going to I'm going to show you this. I love this, guys. I really do. It's It's got some weight in it as well. This beautiful um, pendant necklace. What does it say? Round and tassel charm necklace, multicolour, one size. This was £3.29 um, and it would have been £4. Um, it's on this nice, thick gold gold chain. You can, it's a, what do they call that? A crab claw clasp and then you've got your um extender chain there that's it that's it on the back that's it on the front it's almost like um well it is it's it's pinks in pinks and mauves in color and then you've got that lovely heavy tassel there um you wouldn't believe that it was only um £3.29 so it's got some nice length on it and I bought this for those dresses in fact I bought this for that uh, navy bodycon dress and to go with those lovely new shoes that I showed you on one of my sheen hauls previously um, and I thought oh yeah that'll go really nice you know to accessorize it with the, with the shoes and and the and that navy dress but in actual fact that I've got a dress and I've got another 
bodycon dress here in a different colour that I'm going to show you in a bit and it's going to go with that also. So I really like that um, because I can't really get away with cheap earrings or anything like that so I never tend to look in the jewellery but in actual fact when I saw that and that just popped up and I thought oh I'll have to go and have a little root and toot on there now um, and yeah it's it, they've got some gorgeous stuff on there guys for a fraction of the price you know um, and then I picked up this now you do get what you pay for now I saw this and I thought yes this would be ideal because at the moment I'm using a tray for all my lotions and potions skincare I'm using a tray um, and they're all just in a row you know my, my regime is is in a row on the tray and I thought this would be great but it is cheap it really is cheap it didn't quite look like this on the on the photograph so you have to be careful don't you guys but it's this can you see it's a little bit crooked and stuff I'm going to make it work guys how much was it um four pounds 72 let me see what it says it says um large capacity cosmetic storage box one piece makeup organizer with drawers countertop organizer and cosmetics vanity holder for lipsticks um i'm not going to put my lipsticks in there i'm going to put my, my lotions and potions <laughs> i'm going to put my lotions and potions it's cheap um and it's uneven if you can see that it's definitely uneven but it doesn't matter because i'm going to make it work i'm still going to put it on my dressing table and by the time it, i've filled it up you know when i put my put my creams and stuff um by the time i've done that you would now isn't that funny that is all the same level even though it's cut it looks as if it's coming up so you're gonna have to have your taller bottles at the back obviously and then graduate your bottles down down um and then you can even put some on there and you can put i don't know whatever you would use in there um stuff that you'll forget about because it to me if it's not on display I, I, I do forget about stuff but yeah i'm going to give it a good a good go and uh like i say i'm going to get it to work but you do get what you pay for don't you i mean some of it surprises you on Shein, and some of it surprises you on Shein if you, if you get the meaning so then the next um items are clothing items now i'll very briefly show them yet and then we'll go over there and we'll try them on so this is a dress now i picked this up in a 16 because i wanted it badly i'm not a 16 i'm a 12 14 um but to me there's too much fabric on the skirt and when i show it you um you i mean you might see something that i don't see you might say actually the 16 suit suits you um better than the 12 14 and um, because that 12 14 one of the 12 14s you know the it's either a i'll, I'll show you so this is the colour and I absolutely love it. I love I love happiness and sunshine, you know, in the summer. And that's what this says to me. Happiness and sunshine. And it's my usual, you know, shirt, shirt at the waist. And um, I thought, well, I'll make it work. But I think there's too much fabric around the skirt. But we'll see and we'll see what you what you think about that. So that was that's all over floral print ruffle trim dress and that should have been 10.99 and i picked it up for nine pound two um this is the skirt so though these two pieces may well be going back well this definitely has to go back because by the time i get it on and over my hips and around my waist because my obviously your waist is your, your shortest you know your smallest part when i get it over my hips because it won't sit on my hips um and i get it up to my waist then um it's too it makes it too short so to, you know i can do it up when it's on my waist but i can't do it up when it's on my hips um and again this was a 12 14 um and it's a beauty it really is look at that it's just a and it's a little a-line skirt and it would have been absolutely perfect really would have been absolutely perfect um you know but i've got these hips so you've just got to get on with them yeah i suppose i could try again in a 16 but then i feel that the a line would kick out too too much too much for me anyway um so that's that 
Um, and then I got this, I love this, this uh, the print on this dress. And this is by, um, it says Frenchie. Yeah, she, uh, she and Frenchie all over floral print, ruffle trim dress. And this is 9.78, should have been 11.99. And again, it's my style. It's got the um, V-neck um, and it's got this um, little ruffle sleeve. It's got sheer detail and your full, your full skirt, almost like um, a skater skirt. Um, and then you've got that lovely floral print. So I'm going to try that on. So I'm not even going to bother putting it back in the bag. Um, and then you know me, I lo absolutely love my bodycon dresses and the navy one. So, I, I, you know, I like to have them in most colours. I wear bodycon skirts too. And I, I, ho I always, I always have really um, because um, it's they're easy to wear um, and it's what suits my shape. Um, so yeah, so I picked it up in this. Now it's it's saying it's um, coffee brown. I wouldn't have said it was coffee brown. I'd have said it was chocolate brown. But let's not split hairs about it. It's beautiful. It's t-shirt material. It's stretchy. I picked it up in a twelve fourteen. It's a um, solid round neck bodycon dress, and it's midi in length. Um, so yeah, you can see now, can't you? Now I said that 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 necklace will go with that as well. So yeah, I'm happy with that. So let's go and try these things. Let's go pop over there and we'll go and try these things in. That dress, by the way, was nine pounds too. Should have been um, should have been ten ninety nine. So we'll go over there now and we'll we'll try them. Okay, on. so this is the this is the size sixteen. The the other problem with this dress as well that I forgot to um show you is this they sticking up. I wonder whether I, I steam it and they stay down. But let me just show you uh the skirt because I feel as if the skirt is too there's too much of it. Do you know what I mean? There's too more of me. Um but yeah it's not it I, I absolutely adore the color i really do um um and and this would be nice if they just stayed down because the other skirts the, the other sorry the other dress is exactly the same you know and they're not stuck up like this i look as if <laughs> i look as if a baby's head in a bonnet in one of them bonnets but anyway, so yeah, that's this dress. Um, and I think this one might go back. I'll just hold this skirt up now and I'll show you what I mean with this. This is, I absolutely love this skirt. I really do. But can you see it's A-line? Um, and I, I'm not really one for A-line skirts. So if I, again, if I get this in 16, because it'll, it'll I can do it up on my waist I can't do it up you can see how much bigger my hips are I can't do it up um even on the belly button it has to go up to my waist um because of me because of my hips so um if I've got a bigger size that a line because apart from those everything else is in proportion you know so that A-line is going to come out much more and it's just going to spoil the effect, I think, anyway. But what a beautiful skirt, guys. I really love it. And I can get it on and I can do it up. Um, and it's comfortable on the waist, but it's just too damn short and uh, I'm not prepared to wear it. You know, I'm not I'm not worried about showing a bit of leg, but I certainly don't want to be showing my bum cheeks, guys. Um, so I will just do a quick swap. And we'll go on for this pink one. So this one is really beautiful. I absolutely love it. I really do. I feel as if it's this one has come in a little bit small for me. Normally a 12-14 in this style dress fits me absolutely perfect. But I feel as if the shirt detail, whether it's a, a little um, pattern, that would normally go there. Um, but it's gone a little bit high. 
What I did like about this one that I've not seen on any of these style dresses before is it's got a little press stud. So you can either have that undone or you can cover your modesty um, and pin that like that, which is fabulous. And it's staying in place. Um, these are those sleeves. So you can see on that other dress where they were stuck up. Um, that's not how they're meant to be. You know, this is a lot better. Um, and I, I really do love these um, dresses. Just let me tip you down and then you can see the skirt. Yeah, I, I really do love these dresses. I just think they're so they're so nice um, to wear, so versatile, so easy. You know, these definitely can be dressed up and they can definitely be dressed down. You can wear them with a slider, you can wear them with your chunky pumps. You know, I've got my chunky pump, my white chunky pumps that I often wear these dresses with. Um, you could wear a little um, stroppy sandal, you know, a little, uh, maybe not black, but uh, with this colour, but you could, well, you could actually, because there's, there's quite a dark colour in the dress. You could wear it, and I would wear a sandal rather than a shoe with them. Um, with these dresses, um, because they're a little bit shorter and they've got that bit, little bit more material, you know, around the, around the skirt. It's a full of skirt. Don't know why I'm struggling to describe. And um, then I would definitely wear a, um, a nice sandal, even a wedge, actually, even a wedge. Um, so yeah, I like this. this. This is definitely a keeper and um, I will be wearing this this summer. Um, I've got some lovely dresses off Shein, guys, I have to say. So then the next dress is the coffee brown, as they called it, the coffee brown. This dress I bought in mind with these sandals that I'm wearing. Um, it just so happened, I got this for the, the navy um, bodycon dress and it just so happened that it does go with this as well um i have i i got this because i wanted to put it on with these um sandals because i love these sandals and i want to get as much use out of them as as possible so so yeah i i, I mean i don't know if you can tell but i've you know i've put a couple of pounds on um, i'm telling a little fib it's a pound and a half you know, it was half a pound last week, it's a pound this week. I've definitely took my eye off the ball. Um, and just because I'm um, exercising, I seem to think I can, can get away with it. Well, the scales has told me different, so yeah. Um, but um, we're not here for that anyway, we're here for this. So I thought, yeah, these lovely sandals, I love them so much. I want to get as much use out of them um, as possible. So, I, 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 you know, and I love a body con and I thought, yeah, that's really nice. And it's a... You know, and it's not overly fussy, and I don't feel, I don't feel overly dressed. You know, I, f I feel nice. So yeah, so that's that. I'll meet you back at the table. Yeah. So they, the, the you know, the dress with the sticky up, um, excuse that, the dress with the sticky up sleeves. You know, um, don't know what's going on with this camera today. Um, and the um, the skirt that they're definitely going back. I think my favourite is the bodycon dress. Having said that, I do love a floral dress. Um, my least favourite, I have to say, is this because it's it's cheap and it's crooked and stuff. Um, but you know, at least I'm able to show you as well. I'm still going to keep it, and I'm you know I'm gonna I'm gonna try my best to <laughs> make it look. And so long as it's functional as well, guys. Um, this is absolutely fabulous, as is that. That's going to be invaluable. Um, it really is. So uh, thank you for joining me today, guys. It's It has been lovely to see you. And um, yeah, I think I'm going to be doing some... I'm all higgledy-piggledy at the minute, but I've got I've got my two teardrops to do i have got a another definitely another try on um because i need your help on that one um so do please stick around for that and um yeah i'd love you to subscribe if you haven't subscribed already so do take care guys it's been lovely to see you and i will see you again on what are we on now tuesday i will see you again on thursday if not before um i always say that but then it's never before is it so um, it's probably going to be Thursday. And um, yeah, do take care. See you then. Bye.